We do have a lot happening. Let's get you caught up on some of the other big stories we're following. A 35-year-old man was just taken into custody in New York in connection to sexual assaults in the Sacramento area. ABC 10's Alicia Machado spoke to a woman who says she was one of the victims. New York police and the FBI took 35-year-old Kabe Cummings into custody on Tuesday in connection to sexual assaults that happened in the Sacramento area. Sacramento police say the earliest reported assault happened back in 2010. Sources tell ABC 10 there were a total of three cases, two in the city and one in the county. Investigators tracked him down with DNA. I spoke with a woman who tells me she was one of his victims. She asked to remain anonymous, but says it happened while she was walking home from Cosumnes River College back in 2010. I was going home from college just a regular day. Um, it was dumping rain and out of nowhere, I just had these two guys attack me. Men, she says she didn't know. When it all first happened, I was really hoping that the DNA and everything would help catch him. But like as the years went by, I kind of lost hope. She filed a police report and waited more than a decade. She says she finally found out his identity when police notified her of his arrest this week. I feel like justice is being served. I feel at ease. I got my closure. I know who it is and that he's going to be paying for his huge mistakes. Cummings will be extradited to Sacramento on charges, including kidnapping to commit rape and other sexual assault related charges. So what next? Sacramento police, deputies and the D.A. are planning to hold a news conference on Tuesday morning. So stay with ABC 10 for updates.